Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can turn on and off tools within your Blackboard site. To begin, you'll need to enter into your Blackboard site and select Customization from the control panel. Next, click on the Tool Availability option. This will take you to a page that shows you all of the Blackboard tools available in your site. You can choose to turn these tools on or off by clicking on the checkboxes next to the tool name. For example, you can turn off the default Blackboard blog tool by deselecting the checkbox in the Available column. Blackboard tools also have additional options that can allow the tool to be visible to guests or observers, or to make it available in content areas. You can choose to disable or enable the tool by selecting the corresponding checkbox for the tool. In addition to the default Blackboard tools, there are lots of tools that Case Western Reserve has installed. You can select whether or not these are available in your site, also from the Tool Availability page. For example, you can scroll down and locate the Turning Account Registration link and decide whether or not to enable that in your course. We also have a lot of plugins for third-party content, such as McGraw-Hill and Pearson. You can choose whether or not to turn these on by selecting the corresponding checkbox. When you've made all your changes, make sure you click Submit to save them. You should then see the corresponding tool available in your Blackboard site. That concludes this video about tool availability in Blackboard. If you have any additional questions or concerns, please contact the Service Desk at 368HELP or at help.case.edu. Thanks for watching!